back now as promised with a recipe for edible and safe raw cookie dough. All right, so let's take a look at the ingredients. You will need softened butter. You'll need uh, cane sugar, brown sugar, vanilla extract, and gluten-free, that's very important, gluten-free baking flour, some sea salt, some mini chocolate chips, and if you also want to add some larger chocolate chunks, yes. you can kind of do whatever <laughs> you'd like to take. No question. So this is what we're going to deal with here. We have our finished product, so we, that's already ready to go. We'll eat that in a minute. We can't eat some right now? Oh, well. <laughs> Here, eat, use a spoon. Use a spoon. Yes. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. It doesn't matter how safe you are. Yeah, see, but I want to put the spoon back in there. So well, there's four spoons. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. All right, so how do we get this started? We're going to try to make this okay. over here. All right. We need the butter first. Okay. Right. Along Stuff with this in. butter. the vanilla. Vanilla. Okay. And then we put in the sugar and the brown sugar. We'll mix and we stir over. that first. Melanie, uh, how long do you suggest we stir this? You're the expert. Oh, yeah. Till it's mixed. Till it's okay. Mixed. You got to make a syrup. All right, she it. said that's usually takes two and a half hours, so just keep <laughs> turning. Oh, I don't think it'll take that long. Yeah, uh, yeah obviously a mixer would. The magic of TV. You walk faster, but you're really good at that. That's pretty good. Wow. Well, you know, if you're making chocolate mousse, you have to be able to do this. Wow. Proving that ask. he's not just good in the medical field, he's good in the baking <laughs> field, too. <laughs> but you don't even bake that. But it does yeah. have yeah. a lot of We're going to start bringing like... you back to do cooking segments. Well, I'd love to do that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. So, sure. okay, with the flour. Okay. So, we're ready to go. Are you, you ready? Go yeah. ahead. Okay. Uh -huh. Thank you. How do, we, um, how do we know that this flour is different in terms yeah. of, you know, the bacteria and the things like that with a gluten free flour? Yeah, the gluten free is made of sorghum, it says. Made with sorghum. I mean, we're still trying to figure out why flour mm -hmm. is is contaminated with E. coli. So, I, mm -hmm. I, you know, again, everything's being processed, and if there's contamination anywhere in that processing line, it's going to carry on to the, to the, uh, uh, to the consumer. So yeah. if you're eating raw product, yeah. you're always going to run the risk. Now, do I think the risk is exorbitant? Am I not going to try this? It's got chocolate. You know I'm going to try it. <laughs> is right. he not going to try it? So what is the, and maybe you can explain this, what is the difference? Why whole grain sorghum is the number one ingredient on the back of this label right here. Yeah. What makes that different and why is it okay to eat that as opposed to if I had a bag of regular flour? Well, I mean, the thing that makes this, uh, you know, I, I don't know what this would, if we use regular flour, what this would taste like. Mm -hmm. So I think that's the first thing. We don't have eggs here. Okay. Mm -hmm. And if you look at most cookie dough, you're going to have, right. uh, you're going to have egg in there because that yolk is such a wonderful emulsifier. Right. right. You really aren't having that. Oh, so yeah. you can see it's kind of, it is kind of dry and chunky. Yeah. Okay. It's not smooth. Uh, so that different. may be one thing. But again, uh, if, if this product was being run through the same factory that was processing a wheat, which mm -hmm. wouldn't be because this is gluten free, right. you could get that contamination. Okay. So so, I mean, you can't say that the risk is zero here. Thank you. Okay. Do you like another spoon? Uh, oh, no, I'm, I'm fine, because remember, I didn't touch <laughs> this to my mouth, so. Okay, we're gonna, I'm going to taste what we just made. All right, Dr. Rushton. You have to try, try some, this. too. Let's try this. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Okay. Ball it up a little bit, like I'm making a real cookie. Yeah, it's more, see what I mean? It's more broken up and grainy mm. than... Then add, and then if you had regular cookie dough with the egg in it. Yeah. Mm. It's drier, and you, you do have that granularity of the sugar. Still tastes good. I mean, it's not bad. It's not like a... It's good. I mean, it tastes good, but it doesn't... It's still that. not the... It's not the cookie dough. Yeah, if you're thinking cookie dough, this yeah. does not taste like The emulsifier, like that cookie makes all dough. the difference. But so if you have an egg, and again, I point out when, when we look at Rocky taking six eggs yeah. in a glass and drinking yeah, them straight yeah. down in the movie, if you add the egg in there... I'm not going to say don't eat it, even though you might say that. Well, I think I'm not a doctor. It's, it's though. a, it's a, you know, if I look at the amount of salmonella that is out there, and if you watch cooking shows, you know, they're going to say, listen, the risk is there. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. if you're using fresh eggs, yeah, I mean, would I bring this to a church dinner? Right, and say oh, eat it up. Yeah. Well, absolutely not. <laughs> right. <clears throat> you know, but with you know, you're serving for your family. You've mm -hmm. got all those ingredients. You made right. it all fresh that day. Sure. Mm -hmm. You're going to consume it at that time. Done. The risk is going to be low. That's not zero. Right. Low. But it is low. Yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. Uh, and and of course, anytime you eat anything raw, you know you have risk. So, That's true. Right. Yeah. So you got to be careful. But I think I, I, you know if you've refrigerated this, that might actually it take might taste better later. later. I think okay. so too. Yeah, if you want to try it, I mean, we're right, gonna, it's, not, it's not bad. We're going to post this on our Facebook page. Right, I'll have sure. some more. Yeah. Just right. have yeah. a first look at four, uh, no and you can give it a whirl yourself. Well, thank you for coming yeah. in well, again, thank and thanks for sticking around for this segment. Raw cookie dough. Yeah, absolutely. I'm surprised you tasted it. Well, come.